Bobby. Get life. Don't say excuse me or anything. Mom, Mom, I've got to get to school. Well, Bobby, sit down here and eat then. Can I go to school now? Bobby, don't drum your fingers on the table. It's impolite. <laughs> What's the big hurry, shrimp? I'm, I'm going to meet. Miss Wells wants us to meet some famous kid, Eddie Kit. Eddie Kit? Oh, Bobby, that's wonderful. A mom can have no better dream than have her kid on the Eddie Kit team. Wow. Mom knows Eddie Kit. I told you he was famous. Bobby, Earth needs you. It's under attack from an alien enemy. It happens whenever there's a need for a big box office hit. We need you on our roller hockey team. Eddie Kitt's All-Stars. Bobby, welcome to the team. You'll be the goalie. Goalie? This is Red Dickey for Sports Universe at the Winner Gets Earth Roller Hockey Game. The aliens get a breakaway shot at the goal. Oh, my! Bobby Tenrick makes a save. Beautiful. What's this? The goalie's taking the puck to the other end. Well, this is unheard of. What a smart move. Captain Squash and Etiquette are helping him skate past all the defenders. Oh, my! Captain Squash is ridden out of the play. There's only one defender to get past now. I beg your pardon. If it wouldn't be too inconvenient, I'm going to check you into the boards. Thank you. Thanks to Etiquette, Bobby's in the clear. Bobby's moving now, and Bobby shoots! It's a goal! Earth wins! Etiquette's team wins, ladies and gentlemen! Hey, Bobby, it's not Etiquette, it's Etiquette. What? It's not Etiquette! It's not Etiquette! It's not Etiquette! It's not Etiquette, it's Etiquette! Miss Wells is going to introduce you to the idea of etiquette. It's how you act in public, doofus. That doesn't sound like as much fun as being on Eddie Kitt's team. Oh, Bobby, where do you come up with those gems? Well, let's go or you'll be late for school. Mickey isn't very good at apologizing because making apologies, like other kinds of manners, takes practice. <laughs> maybe he will learn his lesson about the importance of good manners, or maybe he won't. It's pretty hard to tell. <laughs> Bobby. That's my name. <laughs> Bobby Adolphus Generic. Uh-oh. Miss Wells is using all three of my names. Am I in trouble? Mm, it's bad manners to disrupt the movie, Bobby. But you did give me an idea. I did? Mm-hmm. Your assignment will be for each of you to come up with a way of showing why manners are important. And the best one wins an ice cream bar of their choice. <laughs> Double fudge mocha bar. Boy, a double fudge mocha bar. This'll be easy. Couple of pleases and thank yous. Cutting back on picking my nose. But, Bobby, it's not just doing it. You have to show it. How are you going to do that? You want to work together? We can make a movie like we saw in class. But in color. My dad's got a camcorder. Great, Bobby. But it's not a movie if it's on videotape. It's a video. No, it's a double fudge mocha bar. Honey, kids, I've got an exciting announcement. Dad? We're all going to the NAPTI convention. Cool. Epic. Dad? Oh, Howard, Dad? NAPTI? Dad? The National Association of Pants and Tailoring Experts convention? Oh, go on with you now. Did you win? Yeah, you're looking at the winner of the Pants Purveyor of the Year Award, huh? I'm making a video for school about bad manners. Bobby, hey now, put a sock in it. You interrupted your father. Now, what do you say? Please. Oh, no, no, that's wrong. You say, I'm sorry. Why do parents love to ask questions when they already know the answer? The Dorsal Country Club. Nine holes of golf on their championship course, followed by a banquet. Oh, well, for the cry eye, the Dorsal Country Club is pretty exclusivo, don't you know? Kids, you're gonna have to mind your manners. Mind my manners? Whee, Bobby, hand me that, please. Please? Uncle Ted. Did he mind your manners when he were my age? <laughs> it's not mind your manners, Bobby. 
It's mind your manners. Uncle Todd! <laughs> hey, Bobbo! What time is it? Time for nuggies! Hey, Howard, uh, <clears throat> if I'm gonna team up with you for the golf tournament, I'll need to borrow your old set of clubs. Sometimes I wonder if you own anything. Dad, Bobby's making a video about why manners are important. You know, P's and Q's. I want to win the double fudge mocha bar. Well, then I'm your man. You caddy for me tomorrow, and I'll help you with your movie. Like, uh, like an agent. I'll be your manners agent. <laughs> Deal? Say, show me the mocha. Show me the mocha. No, no, come on, put some feeling into it. Shout it out, Bobo. Show me the mocha. Show me the mocha. I think he's got it. Now, Ted, I want you to know something here. This is Howard's big day, so you and the kids be on your best behavior. People at country clubs know the meaning of good manners, don't you know? They do? Where's the camera? I can just taste that mocha bar. Show me the mocha! Show me the mocha! Okay, double fudge mocha bar, here I come! I got the video camera, I got videotape. Am I forgetting anything, Roger? Oh yeah, the lens cap. Run, run, run. Let's see, this can't be hard if Dad can do it. Come on, Roger. Let's ask Kelly about manners. Oh. Kelly, are manners important? What? Uh, Bobby! Get out, you little creep! Don't march into the bathroom when the door is closed! Turn that thing off. Mother! Get out of my room, you little dweeb! Dad, do you know why manners are important? Bobby! My camcorder. I, to I told you never to touch anything without asking first. Oh, for it. Oh, you know, Howard, let Bobby use it. Martha, it is brand new. There you go, then, now yet. It's still under warranty. Well, I just think it's so cheek pinching cute. He wants to make a movie like little Stevie Spielberg. Cute always works on moms. Well, you just run along now and have some fun, hon. But don't go too far. We're leaving for the country club soon. Way to go, Bobby. You got the camera. My folks won't let me near ours. How'd you do it, Bobby? I owe it all to little Stevie Spielberg, whoever that is. Oh, what an imagination. I just love that about you. Yuck, what kind of movie are we making? Well, hey, hey, you kids, now head it up. Time to go to that country club, Bobby. You can see Jackie in a whilesy. Mom says they know about good manners at the country club. Perfect. You tape a lot of people with good manners. Then when you get back, I'll copy the best stuff off onto another tape, okay? Show me the mocha. Ah, oh, pick a lane. Pick a lane! If you can't make up your mind, then why don't you just pick your nose? Oh, Howard, stop setting a bad example for the kids. It's, it's Bobby in that camera. It's, it, it's distracting. Now, now, Bobby, honey, don't bother your father when he's behind the wheel of a car. Oh, for E.T. No, no, I'm not up to... Sit back in the seat belt there. Shoot! Shoot out the window! Go! Hey! What took you so long? Hey, we've got a tee off! I think Dad already did. Uncle Ted, your caddy's here. Your caddy's here. What's a caddy? <laughs> He's the most important guy on the golf course. He carries the clubs. But I don't know anything about golf. Well, only one way to learn golf etiquette. Pick up the clubs and take it one step at a time. <laughs> Guess adults forget to tell you that that first step's a doozy. Okay, that's a squish. <laughs> we better rent a golf cart. Okay, who goes first? You're our guests. You should go first. Guests have honors. Oh, oh absolute demente. Guests go first, grip it, and rip it. Pearls before swine. Boy, they do have good manners, Uncle Ted. Shh, Bobby, you're supposed to whisper when somebody's gonna swing. Bobby, remember, golf is a war between you and the golf course. Let the battle begin! A battle? Does it right, Bobby? Those ill-mannered aliens didn't keep their word. They're back. And this time, it's a winner gets Earth battle on the golf course. A golf war, so to speak. Shh. We need you on our team. 
the Eddie Kit All-Star Golf Team. It would be my honor to have you join us in rearranging some alien thought patterns. This is Red Dickey. Shh. Our sports universe at the Burger Planet winner gets Earth Golf Tournament. We're into a rare sudden death. First one to get their golf ball into the cup wins. The alien gets off a terrific shot. Oh my! That was close. The aliens almost got Earth on that shot. Desert rat body is sizing up his shot. Oh my! The aliens are cheating. They're laying down the smoke screen. It's an impossible shot. What are we going to do, Desert Rat Bobby? Oh, God! This is unheard of. Guiding a golf ball in mid flight. Ah! Oh my! What a shot! It's headed straight for the cup. A hole in one. Earth wins. Bobby, Bobby. Bobby. Shush. you're supposed to whisper when someone is going to swing. Drat! Bobby! Oh, bummer. He didn't keep his head down. Definite mulligan. Bobbo! A good caddy's always supposed to remember where the ball went. Sorry, Uncle Ted. I don't get it. How do you score in this game? Oh, it's easy, Bobbo. You just count the number of strokes. Now, I'm going for a birdie, but if I hit too many strokes, I'll pick up a bogey. Yuck. Mom says you should never pick up a bogey. <laughs> Nobody's picking their nose, doofus. It's golf talk. Drat! Shh. You're supposed to whisper when someone's gonna swing. Guess I'm off my game. Yeah, well, we only lost by 40 strokes, so uh, that's improvement. Did we play the same game? I got great matter stuff on my tape. Just stop there. Cut. Wrap. Whatever. And put that thing away while we eat. Okay. Look at all the balls I found. Bobby, your hands are filthy. Always wash your hands before you eat and get those filthy balls off the table. I need that. Bobby, it's not polite to grab things out of someone's hand. You ask. Sorry, I just want to see what my Matters movie looks like. You know, when I was a boy, we didn't have a remote control. I had to walk all the way across the room just to change the channel. <laughs> Whoa, this is down. <laughs> nice camera work. Silks! <laughs> <laughs> Camera recorded all the wrong stuff. I'll never get my mocha ball. Well, my little filmmaker needs to chow down and eat him up. I'm not hungry. What is it, little manzy? It's my manners movie. It's nothing but a bunch of pictures of floors and ceilings and feet and a bunch of talking. Oh, no, you work so hard. You know what to do when things don't go right, don't you? No, that's why I'm in trouble. Well, let's see. Life is like a kitchen with leftovers, you know? You gotta turn lemons into lemonade and runny fudge into frosting. I think I'll ask that. Oh, well, uh, you, uh, you, uh, learn more from th things, you learn more things from your failures than your successes. My advice? Lay low until it all blows over. Go shopping and accessorize. <laughs> well, you know, Bobby dear, there's a reason for everything. I wish I could find that reason. Hey, Bobble, I know what you could use. A double fudge mocha bar? A noogie! <laughs> Ted, oh, what a surprise. You're just in time for breakfast. Oh, ho, talk about luck. I wish I had luck. What's the matter, Bobbo? Having trouble with your manners movie? Yeah. I don't suppose you have any idea what I should do. Only one thing to do. This I gotta hear. Well, what you do is you gotta get your family to help you make a new one. You know, everybody could show you examples of good manners and so forth. We all work together. Hey, it would be fun, huh? That's actually a brilliant idea. <laughs> it is what? what? What'd I say? What? Well, we could help Bobby make a new tape. I always wanted to be in the showbiz. Would you? Please? Come on, let's do it. What do you say? Oh, 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 See, Bobby, please and thank you are the magic words. Magic words? Thank you, thank you, Dr. Shun. Well, now my partner in magic, Bobby, will make an animal disappear. <laughs> A 
Roger. Disappear. Whoopsies, Bobby. You forgot to say please. Roger. Disappear, please. Uh -huh. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, Bobby, enough, enough, enough. Here's the camera. You're the director. Let's get started. Ahem, ahem. Gimme, gimme, never gets. Please and thank you, get the foot up. Kelly, would you pass the ketchup, please? Of course, Uncle Ted, since you asked so politely. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, Uncle Ted. No, no, it was my fault. Don't worry about it. Gimme, gimme, never gets. Please and thank you also gets the... <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, you can almost see that one. Gimme, gimme, never bets. <laughs> oh, well, no, that can't be right. Oh, I see someone signaling to get into my lane. I'll just slow down. Ted, get out of here! Get it, move! Oh, sorry, here I go. <laughs> I got the uh, Ruth, take 12. Oh, oh, gimme, gimme, never gets. Please and thank you, our best bets! <laughs> What do you say, Bobby? Show me the mocha. <laughs> oh, come on, Roger. I'm tired. Let's go to bed. I came for Bobby's videotape. I'm going to copy the best parts on a new tape to show the class. Bobby! Jackie's here to edit the tape we made. On the table. Got it. And when you reach over and grab a handful of mashed potatoes and gravy that moments before were sitting on your best friend's plate, then you better ask yourself, are oh, manners important? Oh, a tough crowd. Show me the mocha. Show me the mocha. Thank you, Rodney. And now it's time for our final project demonstrating the importance of manners. A videotape made by Bobby and Jackie. It's the wrong video. Where did you get this tape? It was on the table in the red box. Red box? You were supposed to take the one in the blue box. <laughs> Bobby, don't pick your nose. Ah! Dad barged into the bathroom when the door is closed. You're supposed to knock. Don't bother your father when he's behind the wheel of a car. I told you never touch anything without asking first. Now always whisper when someone's about to swing. Oh, oh, gimme, gimme, never get. Please and thank you, our best bet. It's <laughs> wrong. It's all wrong. You're right, Bobby. I was right? No, wrong. But that's bad. No, that's good. What I did was good? No, bad. Are you as confused as I am? It's simple, Bobby. Your videotape demonstrated every conceivable use of bad manners, showing us why good manners are important. I did? I mean, I did! You both did. Jackie did a marvelous job of selecting the best of the video you took. And that's why I'm declaring you both the winners of the contest. <laughs> Bobby, didn't you learn anything about manners? Oh, yeah. I, I mean, yes, I did. So why are you whispering? That's what I learned, to be quiet when someone is going to swing. Show me the mocha! 